Hey everybody, today we're going to show you how to make geese jerky. It's a pretty simple uh, process so uh, it sh you should be able to, it, to do it at home. So you take your geese uh, breast and you come cut it on the si sideways of the breast. The reason I do it, normally I don't cut with the grain but for jerky I, I allow it. This is a pretty big, uh, pretty br big breast so uh, it's going to make a, a good co quantity of jerky. So you come cut it as thin as possible with your with your knife. The reason why we cut it as thin as possible is because it will dry easier and it'll last and it'll last longer on the shelves. It goes with also it goes to say if you uh, if you dry it longer, it'll last longer in, on the shelf also. But if you dry it just two three hours, it might not last as long in in the shelf. You might have to. Uh, freeze it or keep it in the, the fridge so I'll just do a couple more for you guys now after after you cut the pieces see these will make good good long pieces after you cut the pieces we'll marinate it for a couple uh, couple of hours I'll show you how to I'll show you marinate it later I miss, my, I miss my shot on that one. Some people cut the fat off. I leave it on. I think it's okay. I don't mind. All the fat in the white. I don't. I don't want to lose too many meat. Too much meat. So I, I keep it there. If you want to take it off, take it off. It's, it's you. You're the boss, right? But that's pretty much it for the cutting. You cut. You, you cut it as thin as possible. So it'll be easier to eat when you're done. So I'll show you how to make the marinade after I'm done cutting. All right, so I'm done cutting my meat, and I've I've already made the the marinade sauce. But I'll I'll tell you what I put. I put a little bit of uh, black pepper, a little bit of salt, a good quantity of oil. This is peanut oil, but you can use pretty much any oil you you like. Uh, so a little bit of soy sauce and the, the secret ingredient to my marinade is Diana sauce uh, I like to use it pretty much on it on everything so it goes well with everything this is gourmet honey garlic and uh, so you shake it up and you put a, a little bit of water to make it more liquid So now that the marinade is made, you're going to pour it into the bowl with the meat and you're going to come mix it up so that every part gets a good, uh, good part of marinade on it. Hopefully I made enough marinade. Then you're going to marinate it for about 24 hours overnight or some people marinate it just for a couple of hours but I, I like 24 hours a bit. So you come mix it up and you want to mix it up maybe I mix it up about every 12 hours you come give it another shake another you got to put love in your in your jerky. That's pretty good. If it's if it's not up all the way to the top, you, you can want to put a little bit more water on it. But this this is okay. So so I'll put the the cover on it. And it'll go on in the fridge for about 24 hours.
All right guys, so here's the finished product. I dehydrated it for about six hours, so it's still a bit juicy, but it won't last as long in the in the storage room, so I'll have to eat it in the, a couple of days. That should be just fine. So I hope you liked the recipe and uh, give me some comments on, on internet, on email or on the site. And uh, good luck hunting. Bye.